fashion tamer the tame one bringing you guys another wonderful wig review and this wig that i have on my head is coming from the ic company and they're actually are located on amazon so that's right i am bringing you guys another tamed up once again uh this is when certain companies hit me up and i promote their promote their wigs and this is actually one of their wigs that we have tamed up about to uh show you guys so let's get started so when you first get your wig it comes in a box like this and it says i see 100 percent human hair so that's right this is a human hair I believe i got 12 but i think this is 10 inches a 10 inch bob it is lace front and uh, it has a 13 by 4 parting space so it is a full frontal wig so you are able to part it just like i did mine uh so 13 by 4 it's 13 inches across four inches back um there are three combs in the front two on the sides one in the middle and then there is one in the back along with the adjustable straps uh on the back of the box it actually has all of their information basis of how to contact them and where to find them so you can find them on instagram whatsapp facebook twitter and also youtube so even better um i did do a little research about the ic company and i saw that they had a tons of reviews so that was a plus so any company that i work with i try to look them up first but they had a good lot of positive reviews so i was excited to do this and you guys know I don't do bobs all the time, so this is actually a plus. Um, but this is what you get that comes in a box. Nothing nothing much, basic box to store your wig back in and to give you a wig cap. And they actually gave me a wig cap that was around my same skin tone, so that's a plus. Um, let's get into this wig because there are some cons, but they're not really cons. It's just if you're a first-time wig wearer, I would take this to your beautician or someone that you trust with your wigs to kind of help you, mm, kind of help you like customize this unit to your liking. Uh, when you first get it, it comes in a bag, typical bag with a net. Um, the only thing that I didn't like that it looked like it was already pre-cut, so I didn't cut these bangs. These were already pre-cut. Uh, that's a no-no with me. I usually like to cut my own units if I choose so. I don't like it where they automatically cut it for you. Uh, I believe this is 130% density all the way around. The issue is I do feel like that the top is shorter uh, as far as like density wise, like it's less hair up there. But I will say this, that's just for me. I know I like thicker hair. Y'all know I'm used to wearing curly units that are at least 150, 180, or even if the one if it is 130, it's still curly. So this was a little thin for me, but due to the fact that it's still hot outside and in Texas, you kind of never know what the weather's gonna be. Uh, now let me tell you how I end up fixing it. So I end up parting the hair onto the side. Uh, I tried to do a middle part. It did not work out the way I had envisioned it because that's usually how I like my bobs with a middle part. So what I ended up doing was just parting it over to the side and re ironing the hair. And then I used my Nairobi to kind of set it and I also use a wax stick to kind of lay down the hair a little bit flatter. And this is the result. So I hope you guys like it. And I hope this video was kind of helpful to kind of give you some insights of what you'll be getting yourself into if you buy, purchase this unit from the IC company on M uh, <clears throat> My allergies are tripping. So, as always, you guys, if this video is informative and to you guys like it, make sure you like, share, and subscribe to this channel. Make sure you hit the bell at the top to be notified when I, Fashion Tamer, the Tame One, drops another video. And until we meet again, my Tame Raiders, 